I wanted just to shoot a quick video here on uh, what exactly a track sled is. Yeah, you know, there is a commercial company, a Russian company actually, uh, out there making them called Snow Dogs, and it only costs about four grand just to you know get into the real base model and you know quickly jump up to about six. But even then, it's I mean pretty affordable compared to like you know a brand new snowmobile. But uh, this one here is homemade. Um, essentially, what you do is just you know, look for an old snowmobile and uh remove the tack you know the track and the tunnel and that's that's essentially what it is it's just a snowmobile track build a frame just with uh the square tubing and uh what most people you know there's a bunch of good facebook groups out there they're running just the you know six and a half horsepower uh harbor freight predator the 220 212 cc this particular one like i said i bought this so it came with the larger predator motor and uh this is the 420 so it's the 13 and a half horsepower which uh probably more than you know what, what's needed but the nice feature is when you go with this then you could add you know it has electric start you add the battery um this is pretty cool deal you know use this for a headlight you know when i'm driving but comes in handy you know if you're when you're setting up or tearing down your ice shack you know you got that just a basically a portable flashlight but really these things are all about the gearing you know when i bought it from the guy he had it and uh, he had just put a few hours on it uh, ice fishing basically just test driving it and the gearing, I mean, you could change, you know, one sprocket, you know, like this could be a 10 and you change it to a 12 or an 8 or, you know, this one down here, change it a couple, you know, from a 36 to a 32. And it makes such a huge difference because there's so many, you know, there's, you got these, this gearing and this one and then you got these. So now I, I, I kind of think it's a little bit too slow. Um, you know, it definitely works, but if you, you know, if I had to go across a huge lake, it's kind of like, eh. so I did notice that when I'm, when I pull back my throttle, that it wasn't going all the way. So I tried to adjust it, snap the head off. So, yeah, damn, I, I don't know. I'll have to try to tap that out, but let me just, um, I, I should have started the video actually in the street. It's kind of tough to get this uh, bad boy onto the street, but we'll just go for a little ride and normally have a cover on this clutch here but i'm just kind of i'm going for some test rides i want to make sure she's uh engaging right make sure everything's straight you know because i noticed there's a little bit of uh you know like belt residue but the belt looks good so just gonna nice day out i'm gonna see how she operates But yeah, you just stand in the back of this sled, and as, as you can see, I have a bunch of other sleds that are just kind of experimenting. But uh, you know what? Got a choker. about all she's got. I'm not liking it. I'll slip it. Yeah, she's 
go much faster than this. But hey, you know, you can pull this, myself, a whole bunch of gear. But yeah, as you can see, pretty slick. You know, I stand in there. If I was going to go across a huge lake, I'd, I could sit, but and then you would just add, you could drag your ice house back there. I have several other sleds and a kick sled. What I was thinking about is uh, this particular track is studded, so um, I can go on ice. I got a kick sled up there. I could hook that up. Melissa could sit in the kick sled behind this, and then, uh, boy, be great exercise. We can go on a lake and let the dogs run crazy, so... It's an idea, we might have to try that, but yeah, this one here, I'm gonna name her the Snow Donkey. Cause eventually I'm gonna bring it up north and uh, I got a slew I got across that, you know, once it's frozen, this would be perfect. And I gotta, uh, you know, cut some trees down and use this to kind of pull them across and make myself a quarter I road. So leave me a comment, uh, you know, uh, or questions if you have, but um, yeah good fun and now i can just say hey watch my video that's that's what a track sled is all right make it a great day